crumbling. So that is also possible. The present form, <laughs> the temptation for the priest, if he is not careful, is to become an ecclesiastical showman. He is facing the people and he is gesticulating and attracting their attention and stealing a few smiles with some of the people he knows. That's not good at all. I have seen a priest celebrating Mass and looking at the people as radio announcers do. They look at the script for a short and then look at the people, then at the script, then at the people. He was not... I, I was tempted to bundle him out of the sanctuary area. He was distracting the people. We come to Mass not to focus on the priest. We come to Mass not to enjoy ourselves. We come to Mass not to dance. We come to Mass not to clap and applaud each other. We come to adore God. You know the four reasons for Mass. Adoration, contrition, thanksgiving and petition. The word acts helps us in that. A, adoration. C, contrition. T, thanksgiving. And S, supplication. That's why we come for mass. If you want to enjoy yourself, if you want to clap, if you want to applaud, you have the parish hall. After mass, you go to the parish hall. Then you can applaud and the choir can uh, 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 operate and you can say encore again da capo repeat oh maestro you are great uh -huh. you celebrate yourselves there but when we come to mass we don't want to celebrate ourselves we want to celebrate christ in his mistress so you can see there is temptation in either form but there is also a correct way of celebrating both forms the main fault is not in the novus order or the, or the older one. The fault is not in the extraordinary form or the ordinary form. The fault is often in the celebrant and in the people and in the choir which wants to perform as a prima donna and show that they are wonderful. So you see, if the priest celebrates well, Indeed, the ordinary form can be celebrated in Latin, the whole lot in Latin. So Latin is not the problem. Many people make problems for themselves. So we can say to them, through your fault, through your fault, through your most grievous fault. Not through the fault of ordinary form or extraordinary form.